Oh, what a wonderful day in this Minecraft world. The sun is beaming, the cloud, uh, the, the clouds are glooming, and it's a wonderful day, Mon Monquave. Uh, so I think today I'm gonna read a very special book. And it's called Lol. By me, of course, because I'm a very good writer. Lol. Yep. Just lol, because none of you understand what the book is about, only I do, because I'm an intellectual. And anyways, so, oh, let me grab the book, you know, just to carry my intellectualness around. That's not a word, but you know what, I made it up, because I'm that much of a intellectual. Anyways, so, the village is looking pretty nice today, you know, we got the lanterns up, you know, we got the beautiful trees, the grass. Our god over there, we call her, uh, um, Mrs. Tree, you know. She's pretty cool. And uh, we're going to walk up here. That's my neighbor's house. You know, Gleber up there. He's a cool little toad. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Good morning to you, too. And then we got Mr. Tree, the other god in our village. You know, this guy's pretty cool, too. And then, oh, yeah, these new things. We call them, uh, I think these are the new toilets they added in the, in the Roman village. So, these toilets in Rome at the time were actually... Huh. So, anyways, these toilets in Rome at the time were actually called latrins. These public latrins date back to the 2nd century BC, you know, before Christ. And they became places to socialize, you know, just, you know, sit on the toilet, you know, have a good time, talk to your buddy. And then, you know, just let, you know, do the dirty thing, you know, junk in the truck. Uh, uh, got poop, got poop, got poop, get off. Um, okay, anyways, the design of these latrines offered little privacy, as you can see. It was designed like a long bench, uh, uh, it was designed like long bench-like seats with keel openings. It was like the toilet, like the, the, like, the, like, the hole in the toilet was shaped like a keyhole. So, you know, that's kind of cool. But anyways, let's, uh, let's go check out the behind the scenes. Um, this is, this is the, like, sewer part of the, you know the toilets you know because what's a toilet without plumbing oh wait. what's a latrin without plumbing am i right or sewers or whatever the, the the crap so we're entering the the sewers right now you know it's filled with all tons of poo and stuff like that you know dried kelp fit what how are you still alive my friend this thing is covered in feces oh i got a piece of cook mine i guess the sheep drowned in here oh hey charles how you doing oh, wow. Um, what are you doing at this time of day in the sewers? Isn't isn't a little early for you? It's like six forty. I got stuck. You, you what? I got stuck. You got stuck? Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Your mouth is kind of like embedded in the cobblestone. That's not looking good. Yeah. Um. Do you mind reading me what that sign says over there? Your head's kind of in the way. Ah. Uh. I can't read. Oh, that's okay. You're a little cuckoo in the head, anyways, with that big forehead of yours. Um, can't. Uh, um, can you move? Uh, it's kind of hard. Um. Uh. uh Let me uh, try. Oh God. Okay. So the Romans had a very complex series of plumbing, as you can see, with this um linear path. Anyways, so we're gonna go up here to the sewers. You know, it's pretty cool. Um, a no, a b two brown dyes. That must have been the poop um, that that um lizard had earlier. You know, guess it was traveling down. Oh, the creepy guys following me again. God, God. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Uh, okay. So as we come out of the sewer, the poop dealer, my good old friend, the poop dealer. How you doing, my friend? Hello, friend. I'm doing good. How are you? Doing great. Oh. Doing great. Can you read what those two signs say, please? Just yes, sir, this is where the uh, poop ends up. It goes through the tunnel into these vases. Uh, these vases are uh, used to holding the Roman turd poops until they are cleaned out by our slaves. Coolio! So as we come out of this little, uh, I don't know what you call it, I guess the little uh, doo-doo, the doo-doo house. 
Um, this is the wonderful village of Rome. I hope you enjoy. And big thanks to uh, Shirely Sunday, also known as uh, Cuckoo Head Charles, Gleber, also known as Morgan Gonzalez, and Bio RJ, also known as Rajvir. You know the guy who uh, literally had a stick and a bucket of cement. I just want to thank you, and also uh, thank uh, you to Will for. Just um, that was me. Yeah, yep, yep. That dash him right there. Helping out, oh. builder. Oh, I, I oh damn. <laughs> Well, ah, my leg. <laughs> well, anyways, I hope you enjoyed.